Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel and my art studio. I am Mrs B, your Catholic art teacher. Boys and girls, today we are going to make a lollipop. Yes, here we go again with that lollipop again, boys and girls. But this time we're going to make a lollipop using pipe cleaners and popsicle sticks. So let's get started, boys and girls. So first you will need um, four, um, four pipe cleaners, two blue and two uh, red. And then what you have to do, you simply twist them around like that. You hold it and you twist it, twist it, twist it. And you can do this on your own. You don't need any help. You don't need anybody to do it for you. You can try this on your own. It will help you very much with your uh, motor skills. It will help you. It will help you in your writing. It will help you, you know, even though, you know, with art and VPA and, and, and creativity, it helps you indirectly with your other subjects, you know, boys and girls. So that's why it's always um, advised that in your um, curriculum, you should have some sort of, um, of uh, art, creativity, things like that in, in, in as part of your subjects. So, um, yeah, so you twist it around until you get something like this. So you have two of them right now. And what I want to do, I'm going to connect them together like this. We're going to twist it around each other so that they make one piece like that. And what I'm going to do, boys and girls, I'm going to start with a pipe, a uh, toothpick, and I'm going to take an end and I'm going to, I'm going to twist it around my um, pipe clean, at my toothpick. I'm going to pull it out and. By my hand, I'm going to twist it around like that, very loosely, very loosely like that, boys and girls. We're going to twist it around because we're going to make this swirly lollipop. That's right. So we're going to do that. I'm going to go around very, uh, try to twist it around very tightly so that it, it looks um, uh, like it's all together and when you twist it around it, it you know it makes a beautiful pattern boys and girls doesn't it so you go all the way around round and round like that and you go around and there you have your beautiful lollipop like that and what you do at the end, boys and girls, watch carefully what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the end and I'm simply going to tuck it in like that. And yeah, very neatly done. And uh, yeah, no problem at all. So let me just do that again because it, um, I bend it. It got a bit too bendy. Let's try it again. Just do it here. Just make that straight so that we can twist that around. All right, boys and girls. Okay, and go around, around, around the garden. That's right. And then I'm going to place it down. It will help me more. Right, and I'm tucking it in then. And then you just tuck that nicely in like that. And you just tuck it in. You can go over and under or under or over. It doesn't really matter. Once you tuck it in, it should be okay. So you just go. There we go. And I've just tucked it in. Very swiftly I did that. And then just try to make your lollipop nice and flat 
uh, one good way of keeping it nice and flat is putting something heavy like a big stone or something on top of it like that and you leave it for a few minutes then boys and girls you need a pop popsicle stick uh, the colors that I chose for the lollipop is red and blue and I've got the white and these colors symbolize the national um, the Union Jack and uh, the, the, the color of the flag of, of, of England and of France and of America, red, white, and blue. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna stick that on and I'll get back to you in a minute. I decided to show you how. So you add some, about this much will be fine. And then you add your lollipop on top of the popsicle stick like that. And make sure that it's lined up like that. And then that's when we need our heavy weight. And then we leave it to dry and then I'll see you in a mo. Just trying to open it up a little bit that it sits well like that there it is boys and girls all nicely stuck down I was going to use googly eyes that I said that for this project a nice big googly eye but I said that'd be too big you know it would be too big so I went ahead and I cut off uh, a medium sized googly eye. If you've got the googly eyes, go ahead and use them boys and girls. Uh, so you just stick on the googly eye, however you want to have it. Yeah, boys and girls, and that's that. So let's just add some glue. One there for that googly eye and one here. And uh, stick it down. You can have one eye looking down that way and one eye looking up this way. Yeah, it makes it all googly. That's where the googly comes from, that word googly. And then we can put a stone on top of it just to keep it there. And then when it's nice and dry, I'll get back to you, boys and girls. There it is, boys and girls. And I can't wait to see your lollipop. Please share with me, boys and girls, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.